A developing story here at six, we'll call it a bathroom battle. In the wake of the delicious licks challenge on TikTok, that's the one that dares students to destroy school property. BISD has had to implement new bathroom policies. Some parents telling 12 News reporter Dominique Lay that they're worried their kids won't be getting enough bathroom breaks. Dom is with us live. Jordan, BISD says this new policy is meant to crack down on school vandalism. But some parents say this is totally unnecessary. And I spoke with one mom today who says her son was denied access to the bathroom say it was probably about three or four hours he had to hold his stomach. Jolyn Benson is talking about her son. He goes to Marshall Middle School. He faces some challenges as he was born with a ruptured intestine and cerebral palsy. But going to the bathroom, Benson says, shouldn't be one of them. So he has to kind of hobble around and he was telling me that he was like, Mom, it takes me long, so long to get in between classes. I don't have time to go in between. After restrooms in Vincent Middle School were found to be severely damaged, BISD adopted a new restroom policy. Right after lunch, he had to use the restroom, and when he tried to go into the bathroom, one of the teachers stopped him and told him no, that it was not his time to go, and that he wouldn't be able to go. A policy where students are only permitted to use the bathroom during scheduled times, and so they can be supervised. BISD tells me the schedule provides for certain classes to utilize particular facilities and ensures appropriate monitoring of students. But what happens if you have to go outside of that time? Well, there are three emergency passes for students to use throughout the week. And if your child has a medical condition, BISD says they'll make accommodations for those students. But Benson says her son was denied and she's not happy about it. She says there has to be another solution. We have to teach our kids that they can't destroy public property. If they do, that there'll be consequences for them. Um, so I feel like BISD does have to address the situation, but at the same time, we shouldn't punish every child for the poor choices of others. BISD says each campus can implement their own policy, and so far, it's Marshall and Vincent that have implemented this bathroom policy. In Beaumont, Dominique Lay, 12 News.